what do we want? What do we want? I want whatever I want, right? <laughs> I, 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 want, I want what I can taste. I want what I can feel. I want what I can smell. Well, I can't smell, so I, <laughs> that's... But most people, you know, we want those things that make us happy today. And how do we, how do we balance out our wants today that we can feel, touch, smell, make us feel good, gets us up in the morning, it's the reason we get up, uh, to those wants of tomorrow that we don't feel at all. For many of you, you can't even imagine it because we're so much into today. But what you're doing today is going to affect your choices tomorrow. Your choices when you get old and you can't work, when you aren't as healthy. And it's important to have choices. And I would try to convince you that you want to think about that. That maybe we should deprive ourselves a little bit. Deferred gratification. Deferred gratification so we have choices tomorrow. 70% of the people in the United States retire broke. And most of them made enough that they could have been millionaires the day they retired. They just need to save some. But they had to do it, they had to be consistent, they had to have practices, they had to have habits that made that work. Because it's a battle. <laughs> because our desires, our wants, they're real today. And you aren't going to snap your fingers and change your habits or what, but you can work on it. You can work on it. You can change the little patterns, you can change the little things that give us little choices so we can save more. We don't spend as much. We don't have as much debt. Think about it. Be intentional about what your future is going to be.